So it's the holidays and as such, I wanna make sure that our house is, is up to par with the neighbors. We just bought this house, so obviously, you know, we're learning as we go. This is our first house, first time we're doing any renovations, which we've done all of our renovations ourselves. But at the same time, you know, it's the holiday season, you gotta keep up with the Joneses. Hence my pirate Christmas sweater that I got. Um, so yeah, let me show you what we got. Rainy, come on. Don't go in that mud. Oh, she's in the mud. Okay, and she's coming up here to make our house dirty. So basically, I have to get up here and somehow I have a ladder. I'm gonna get the ladder, go up there, do the, uh, do the installation of these hooks. I'll show you a little bit more in the future, but basically, oh, that is not the ladder I'm gonna use. That ladder is way too short. Um, yeah, we need to clean the gutters out. It's a uh, collecting some water in the rain. There's no rain today, so it's kind of like the perfect day. So now I'm gonna go to the, uh, the hardware store and see what I can find. So contrary to what everyone believes, you know, I, I obviously I'm a real estate agent, but I'm not as astute when it comes to doing home maintenance. You know, I'm like a first time home buyer myself and this is our first house. All of these things I'm gonna be trying to do uh, in the next couple of months are, it's my first time doing them for myself. You know, I've watched videos, I do the whole YouTube thing, being a creator myself, but at the same time, you know, a lot of these things that I'm doing, I'm terrified to do. I used to be scared of heights, this will be the first time that I've not only climbed onto a roof to do any sort of real work, uh, but it's also the first time that you know I will be doing something that directly benefits my safety. So everything that I'm going to be doing is going to be, you know, to the best of my ability. Yeah, I'm excited to see how this pans out. So that's what we're going to be trying to do. Success! Alright, so I got the goods. Spoke with the, uh, the associate that was working today. Talked to him about the install and what my goals were. And they said it was going to work if I do it correctly and follow the instructions. I would love to follow the instructions. That's the type of person I am. And my door's still open. Alright. We are racing the clock. We are racing the sun because for some reason, Pacific Northwest gets dark at like 6 o'clock now. Alright, so a lot of you probably noticed I went to Home Depot. Really, really it's like the closest place that has the most uh, products for whatever you need for home buying. We've probably spent, I don't know, like ten to fifteen thousand dollars after moving in. Now when you first buy a house, you don't have to spend that much money, obviously, uh, but we are choosing to do a lot of renovations and so they've been really awesome. So the things that I bought, I bought four, four uh, permanent 
install hooks that I'm going to be putting onto the, the roof myself. Um, those cost me around, I think it was 20, 20, 21 dollars a pop. And then I bought the harness that you will wear while you're up there whenever you're doing any work. Uh, that was about 50 dollars, but it, you know, it's something that you're going to use that protects you. Can't put really put a price on safety. And then I also bought the actual uh, cord that connects to the hook on the roof that will connect to the harness. The way I factored in, you know, how long of a cord I wanted, I chose the 12 foot cord because obviously our roof is pretty tall. You don't want a cord that's long enough to, you know, reach the ground if you fall. But at the same time, you want a little bit of length so that you can get around and do your work. I'm putting on four hooks periodically throughout the, uh, the roof surface. So, you know, I will be able to detach and retach when I move my way up the roof. Uh, so yeah, you're gonna see you're gonna see me doing that install and so let's let's cross our fingers and hope that we can do it right. 